And here are the teams coming out now. And an Athletic in our usual gold and black. Sterling Albin in a normal all red strip. So. Thoughts for today, Neil? I think it'll be a really tight game today, Gordon. Uh, Sterling Albion have only played three games since January, you know, the turn of the year, so they've been a bit stop start. Great last minute win for them. They'll have buoyed them last week. Um, I think Cannon as well. I don't think we've had a bad performance this year, you know, even in the two defeats, oh. four foot home, Dumbarton last week. The boys are very unlucky not oh. to come away with something last week at Dumbarton, but, you know, Dumbarton are maybe just showing themselves as a team that couldn't get results and are maybe heading in the right direction. Right. So they are. So. So welcome to the highlights package from Gala Bank for all the Annan supporters and Stirling Albion supporters. So Annan win the toss and are playing down towards the motorway in the first half so they can pay to the cop in the second half. Stirling Albion to kick off. <coughs> Kyle Banner going to get us underway here. Aye, Annan's got a settled formation now, Neil, in the last four or five since Willie Gibson's come in. Good results, same steady performance. Yeah, the, even the, the front part of the team as well, you know, the front five, if you want to call it that, hasn't changed much at all, you know, so. I think Dominic Docker has really come onto a game since he's come, the chance to come back yeah. in. Tommy Muir, good clearance, Tommy. I think he's got to commit there. Uh. <coughs> Great defending, Scott. I think Scott up. I think on the halfway line, Tommy Muir's got to commit to that challenge. Aye, eh? aye. Even if he, you know, wipes him out, I think he's got to. But it's a good booking. <laughs> oh, that was very. I just say his confidence isn't been top nil. That's a good ball. Max kills Benny for oh, the header. Oh, just over. And he's notching not goals in his last two aye. home appearances. Wins this is in. Over the top, I'm done. Oh, and ball! He's off! Oh, he's just... Ooh. He's got to send him off. Oh, he's right. He's right. He's right. Ah, he's off. Oh. He's off. Hey, he's, hands are up there. I think it's a the, the linesman's gave it. He has. The referees took his time to think about it there. And right, li li linesman's gave it. It definitely looked like that first thing for me. But controversy early in the game. Is that another book in there as well? Right. And I hear the press home advantage. Great oh, okay, punch again. Yes! Yeah! 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 Aiden Smith for Anon Athletic. Great cut back there and run from Reese Lyon. We cut it back and well finished. Left foot flick from Aidan Smith. Of course, he's not playing the left, that right hand side there. Well done, Chris Johnson. I'll probably see Chris come on into the. Oh, what a cross. Oh, Ooh, corner. Corner kick. That was Aye. a good block. Oh. That's good for us, though. A free oh. kick, that's a booking. <coughs> oh, could be a goal here, Tony. Yes! Oh! Well played, referee. Well done, referee. Brilliant by, to brilliant by Tommy, Tommy Goss. Here. Right. Tommy Goss, sorry. Tommy Goss, great play. Great strike by Tony Wallace. He's still going to book him, though. I think the number five knows that's coming. Uh, it's a double whammy there. Set Max, no score there. He's got to give it the other way. <coughs> Aye. That's half time. <laughs> oh, the referee's going for half time. So half time at Gallabank <coughs> is Aaron Athletic 2, Sterling Albion 0. No. Go. Oh, right. <laughs> Both on. Turn the bottom, turn the ten pass, late tackle and touch with Gibson there. Oh, we're in here. Yeah. 
We're still a wee bit, a bit nervous, is it? you know. What? Scott Hooper, good play. Oh, I'm away. Oh, yes. Go on, son. Oh, go on yourself. Oh, oh it's got to score. What a Tommy. chance. Oh, what a run by Reese Lyons into oh. Tommy. Tommy's hit his sweet layer. It's just hit the bar and over. Class to watch. Oh, yeah. Oh, good play. <coughs> good move, great build up there. Chris oh. Johnston, ball and Willie Gibson. And oh, two class players there. Tommy, get it an angle. That's it. Max. That's it. Okay. Right idea. Good effort, aye, why not? <coughs> Ross Davidson looking like he's going to clip one in. What oh, a save. save, Greg. What a save. Yes. And again. <coughs> Fun. What, what a, a goal. Strike. What a strike. That's the best goal I've seen at Galabank this season. From Kieran substitute Moore. Kieran Moore. <coughs> Just shows you how important that save was. A Greg Fleming's there. What was that? Earlier on. What a strike. You know. Keep <laughs> What's going on here? This gives us a wee lift. Ross Davidson. Ross McGeeke. Oh! The strike as well. Two World Cup <coughs> goals in the space of two minutes. Some right back, Ross McGeeke. What a strike. To, with his left foot into the top right hand corner. Offside. Oh! <coughs> Kieran Moore, the substitute there. Looked off. The oh, I don't think that's it's the best option. Or the, you know what I mean? Like, I'm we're playing the wee short boys in here. Oh, pass. Benji. Oh! The pace, pass him in. Go on, Willie. He's had a wee slip. Oh, oh Willie Gibson off the post. No. What a strike. Did it hit the post? I hit the head straight behind it. Oh, straight behind it. <laughs> Scored that. Adam Cummins with a long ball in. Right. And full time at Galabank. Definitely two points dropped. And Athletic two. Definitely. Sterling Albion two after a 10 minutes sending off for goalkeeper. Curry and Athletic 2 0 up. Missed an excellent chance to make it three. But two World Cup goals from Sterling Albion make it 2-2.